The column is one of the easier pieces to make. In order to cut it, you just have to cut down this solid line right here in the middle. Make sure when you cut, you go slow and careful. You want your cuts to be as perfect as possible. Once cut, to fold it, all you need is two things. You need a ballpoint pen and a ruler. Well, three things, because you do need some tape. But to fold it, what you're going to do is on these dotted lines, you want to make your ruler line up along the dotted lines, use your ballpoint pen, and you want to press kind of hard. And what that will do is that actually makes a little bit of a dent in the paper, and it may not be able to see it in the video, but it makes the paper dented, and so when you fold it, it's going to want to naturally fold on those dents. And so it's called scoring the paper. Once we've drawn our lines, we're ready to go ahead and start folding our paper. And you'll see that uh, since we've scored it, it folds really easily, nice and straight. Now what we need to do is we just fold it into a box, and then we're going to tape it. Make sure when we tape it, do not tape it past these. And on the columns, there's one last thing that will need to be done, is you're going to cut the corners of one side only. In order to join two columns together, you're going to take the not cut end and you're going to put that inside of the cut end. And you're just going to kind of join them up there where the lines are and then just tape it down and it's as easy as that. To attach a column to the base, what you're going to do is you're just going to bend the tabs down, making sure that you fold them on those lines. And then what you'll do is when you stick it down to the base, you're going to put tape across the flaps and that's going to hold it down. So again, it'll be taped onto your base as so.